friends, this is the Mrs. Wolfie from our Half Acre Homestead. <clears throat> I have a cold, but I'm over the worst of it, so now I'm going to bake some comfort food. I want to make banana bread, but I'm going to add some raspberry. So let's make banana raspberry bread. Now for this recipe, you can use any dried fruit you want, but I'm going to use these um, freeze-dried raspberries sent to me from Evie in Saskatchewan. Um, it calls for one cup of sugar, but I'm only using, I I'm using less than half a cup. Three eggs, baking powder, cup and a half of flour with a half a teaspoon of cinnamon. Let's get started. First things first. We got our three nice uber ripe bananas and we're just going to toss them into the KitchenAid and I'm using the whisk bar because my beater bar broke and this one which I thought was size for this one it's actually too small it fits but it doesn't scrape the bottom of the bowl so we're going to use the whisk let's get those bananas going and while our bananas are whisking I'm going to add a teaspoon and a half of my homemade baking powder. Let's make it a two teaspoons. Let's get our sugar in there. Get our three eggs in here. And our oil. Buttered a cake pan, probably a nine by nine. And now we're just very carefully gonna put in our dry ingredients. And now I'm just going to add probably a cup of dried raspberries. You can use raisins, nuts, whatever you want. We don't want to break these up, so, oh geez, I used over a cup. And we just want them lightly mixed in. Now our oven is preheating at 350 degrees. If you are using frozen or dried blueberries, just mix them to stir. Like just stir them in. Don't over mix them, they'll break up because they're raspberries. And this is going in a 350 degree oven for 45 to 55 minutes. Okay, so our timer has gone off and folks, it is not 45 to 55 minutes. This was only 30 minutes, and look at that, and I wish you could smell it. Oh, and there we go. Now, you shouldn't cut it when it's hot, but I'm going to show you anyway. Isn't that beautiful? This is a really nice recipe, especially the combination of the bananas, which make, usually make the cake uber, uber moist, and the de dehydrated raspberries. Turned out beautiful, and it does not need more than a third of a cup of sugar. Yummy. Sorry, this one doesn't have a lot of pieces of raspberry in it, but the rest does, as you can see. This is a Miss Wolfie from our Half Acre Homestead saying, Banana Raspberry Cake. What a treat. Take care. God bless.